Blood Transfusion and Its Effects, Carol, posted November 2009. Hi, Billy. Thank you for answering my question about Obama and what he is doing for the U.S. Indeed, I hear in news what he is doing for the country, and I so want it to be true. I wish it was that simple, that we can know it is true, but we are constantly told by many sources that his promises are lies and that ultimately he is going to ruin our country, that he is actually taking away our freedoms and is turning the U.S. into a socialistic nightmare akin to George Orwell's 1984. We have been lied to so much by our government that many of us do not trust anything they say. That is why I asked you for some insight on the truth. Thank you for your clear-minded observations. On a completely different topic, I have read in your writings that it is not a good idea to transplant organs from one human to another because of the effect of fluidal forces. Is it the same for blood transfusions? Answer. No, there's no problem with blood transfusions with regard to fluidal forces. There is a very low influence from donated blood. In contrast, transplants of inner organs have severe effects autoimmune system, character, personality, mentality. The strongest fluidal forces are concentrated in a person's brain and heart.